Why have Chelsea bought Cole Palmer, a highly rated young player from Manchester City? I think he's a good player. I thought after the uh, Community Shield, I thought he'd get a little bit more time at Man City to wait. Well, obviously, Cole Palmer is a fantastic prospect, but there's actually another possible benefit here. When he come on and scored, when he scored the goal. So, yeah, a bit shocked, if I'm being honest. A bit shocked, but good signing, good player. He has been one of the most exciting talents in the Premier League this season, and he's just been called up to the English national team, but Cole Palmer's London lifestyle has shocked more people than his meteoric rise. Just how did he go from a young, scrawny kid in Manchester to a world-class talent? How about his crazy lifestyle, luxury properties, and network? Let's get into all of it. Cole Jermaine Palmer was born on 6th of May 2002 in Wythenshire, a suburb of South Manchester in England. As the second son out of three children in a middle-class family, Palmer had quite a childhood. His father is a former footballer of Caribbean descent and introduced the game to his boy. Palmer's first academy was at NJ Wythenshaw, a local club in his hometown. Despite being smaller than all the kids on the block, Palmer was lightning fast and miles ahead of them technically. At the under-8 level, Cole Palmer chose Manchester City over Manchester United following his dad's advice. Palmer rose through the ranks despite being on the smaller side and eventually became the captain of the under-18 side, leading the team to both the league and cup glory. Palmer's father was responsible for choosing CAA Base Limited, an agency that has also managed big names like James Madison, Youngman's son, and Rafael Varane for his son. Truly, Palmer's father put in the work to shape Cole into the player he is today. Meanwhile, Palmer's mother would drive the youngster to training and make sure that he had everything he needed. Growing up, Palmer looked up to Manchester United legend Wayne Rooney as his idol. He was privately educated at St. Bede's College, a Catholic school in Manchester, but was able to balance his studies with his football commitments. And here's what his career is looking like at the moment. Supported by his family, with the right work ethic, and an extraordinary growth spurt, Palmer soon found himself ahead of his fellow youngsters in Manchester City, and in no time, Pep Guardiola had him training with the first team. Palmer then made his first team debut for Manchester City in September 2020 and had a couple of impressive appearances, scoring six goals in 41 appearances in all competitions for the citizens. He was part of Pep Guardiola's treble-winning squad, scored in their recent Community Shield loss to Arsenal, and produced a man-of-the-match display against Sevilla in the Super Cup. Meanwhile, Palmer also helped his country to win the Under-21 European Championship. Even Guardiola admitted that a talent like Cole Palmer was difficult to find. Palmer plays as an attacking midfielder or winger, but the manager just couldn't provide him with a more prominent role because of the stiff competition at the club. Palmer, on the other hand, made no secret about his desire for regular action, but it was quite surprising to see him join City rivals Chelsea for £42.5 million on a seven-year deal this summer. After 15 years in the blue half of Manchester, Palmer became the 11th player to join Chelsea in the summer, and since then, he's been making the headlines almost every week. A last-minute goal from the penalty spot against his former club City, and a couple of goals and assists to his name, all effectively ending any doubts about his price tag. Palmer's short Stamford Bridge career and his brilliant start to life in London has seen him earn his first senior England call-up for the Euro 2024 qualifiers against Malta and North Macedonia in what seems to be the perfect timing. After establishing himself as one of the most important players at Chelsea, bringing with him a creative and goal-scoring force, the 21-year-old believes that his impatience is paying off. Despite his slight physique, Cole Palmer is anything but a pushover. Best with the ball at his feet, his understanding of spatial movement, and razor-sharp awareness in tight areas, plus a lethal left foot means that he is always going to be a problem for defenders. But why don't we take a glimpse into his personal life? A peek into Palmer's social media accounts show no trace of a partner at the moment, just photos of himself or with his family and teammates. It appears that career is the priority for the 21-year-old. At some point, the midfielder was rumored to be dating a girl named Mia, who is a model and influencer. The word on the street is that they've been together since 2021, but we can't confirm that just yet. But what we know is that Palmer has an interesting lifestyle. Apart from being highly dedicated to his career, Palmer has an interesting life away from the pitch. He is incredibly down to earth and loves to hang out with his buddies or play PlayStation. That's kind of what you typically expect from a regular youngster. Palmer once dealt with Ronaldo Nazario in a recent custom Call of Duty Warzone tournament before making a lighthearted comment about the situation. But there is more to Palmer as a person. Check out this viral clip where he shows his rap skills. Interestingly, Palmer, whose other name is Jermaine Cole, says he doesn't really listen to much J. Cole. Rather, he's big on his UK rap. 
He also believes that his Caribbean heritage from his dad's side helps him with his rap. Palmer also spends some of his free time swimming, cycling, hiking, or skiing. He doesn't have any tattoos at the moment, but that could change in the future. But life down south isn't all rosy for the 21-year-old, who has complained of one thing in West London. Palmer has complained that driving in the area is quite annoying because of the traffic that he has to face. Although he mentioned that London is hotter than Manchester, he doesn't really have a problem with it. Palmer has a relatively humble lifestyle and tries to live life like every other normal person who isn't a football star. Palmer has a moderate lifestyle to complement his massive earnings. Despite being in the early stage of his career, Palmer already owns a beautiful apartment in Manchester in the northwest part of the country. His family reportedly has real estate properties in Withenshaw, and no doubt, he's living his best life at the moment. Having moved to London in the last couple of months, Palmer admitted to needing help from his mom because he moved into a new house in Surrey, close to the club's training ground in Cobham. This guy even admitted that he needed to learn how to cook and use a washing machine. When it comes to luxury cars, Cole Palmer is no slouch. He drives a black Mercedes AMG C43, worth more than $60,000, and has some fancy cars in his garage. The newest model of the vehicle drops two cylinders, giving it a turbocharged 2.0 liter, four-cylinder rather than the V6 found in previous models with more emphasis on performance rather than just efficiency. The sedan can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 4.6 seconds. Palmer is clearly a fan of automobiles, and we won't be surprised to see him add many more vehicles into his garage. Cole Palmer currently earns around 75,000 pounds per week at Chelsea which brings his yearly salary to almost 4 million pounds per year. This is a significant increase from his wages at Manchester City, where he earned around 10,000 pounds per week at some point in his early career. Of course, Palmer still isn't anywhere close to being the highest earner at the London outfit, but when you remember that he's just 21 years old and has his whole career ahead of him, that figure is quite impressive. On top of that, Palmer has numerous endorsements with top brands such as Boohoo Man. He also has Nike as the sponsor for his boots. Putting it all together, we expect Cole Palmer's net worth to be around $16 million. Cole Palmer participates in a couple of charitable events as well. We saw him play during the charity match between Barcelona and Manchester City that took place to raise funds for the investigation against DLA. But we have to talk about one or two controversies that Palmer has been involved in. While they were still teammates, Sergio Gomez blasted the behavior of Palmer in England's Euro Under-21 final win over Spain. According to Gomez, Palmer's antics were a bit over the top, and the Palmer did not apologize for anything after the match like some of his teammates did. And very recently, Man City fans also labeled Palmer a traitor after finding out that he got booked in the first half for scuffing the penalty spot, which irritated the fans during the Citizens 4-4 draw against Chelsea. But let me ask you, what do you think of Cole Palmer and his future at Chelsea? 